Hello everyone, welcome back to our another video. How are you all? How was your day? I hope you are enjoying your day. So in this video, we are going to learn about the next block, which is your sensing and we will learn about the control block. Okay. So for that, we have to take one new project. So you need to just go to the file, click on new. It means you are creating one new project. Okay. So you will get one fresh window here. So this is our cat sprite. Even if you want, you can add any other sprite. So suppose I want to add bat. So we have a cat. We have a bat. Okay. So now let's start our control block. So first thing control means what? If you want to apply any condition. For that, we are using this control block. A condition in the sense, like, suppose when I click on the flag, okay, I want to repeat, I want to move this cat only 10 times, okay? So, you need to just go to the motion, take this repeat, move 10 step. Like, see, if I will run, you will get bad movement only 20, 10 times, see? Okay, so this is one condition, right? Okay, after that, we have a forever. This is our second condition. So, what is difference between repeat and forever? Forever will move again and again. See, if you will take your bat here. So, this is forever. Okay. And this is your repeat. Repeat only repeat. See 10 times. If you will add 20, it will repeat 20 times. Okay. Whatever number you will write here based on that, that will repeat. Okay. After that, we have our next control, which is F. Now, here we need to apply some condition. What condition you can give here? Like if, suppose I want to take this. If that will touch to your sprite one, means if this bat will touch to the cat. So what we want to do, we will start one sound. I will take this. Now see what you will get. You will get this on because see this bat is touching to the cat. So, by using your if, you can apply some conditions. Okay. Again, in the control, we have if, then, else. Like, what is this? So, as you can see in your if block, we don't have a else. Like, if your bat will touch to the cat, then only you will get the sound. Otherwise, not. But in if, else, if your bat will touch to the cat we want to start the sound else we want to say hi or say hello now see if i will take my bat here you will get hello why because this bat is not touching to the cat if i will take this here now see you will get sound it means here we have a two condition if this will happen so you will get the result if this is this will not happen so you will get your else part okay after that we have a next you need to wait until wait until means we have to wait until this condition will satisfy okay like that we have a repeat until we have to repeat this thing until this condition will satisfy for example see this When flag is clicked, we have to repeat until you like uh, you have to touch to this bright one. We want to start a sound. Now see. You will get the sound until this bat will touch to the cat. So this is our another control. So with the help of control, we are controlling entire game we can see. Okay. After that, in the control, we have a stop or like a, you want to stop the project. Even we can create a clone also. Suppose create a clone of myself. Like see, you will get two. If I will run, you will get one more. 
सो दिस इज लाइक वी आर क्रिएटिंग द क्लोन क्लोन मीन्स डुप्लीकेट यू विल गेट एंड वेन यू विल स्टार्ट द क्लोन सो वट यू वॉन्ट सपोज आई वॉन्ट टू मूव here we are creating the clone but when clone will create so what we want to do we want to move see and we want to move this forever now see when your clone will create your clone will move okay so this is our next control which is you have to create suppose after that i want to delete this clone after that you can delete that okay so this is our entire control block okay so thank you so much for watching this video please like share and subscribe our channel and press the bell icon if you want more latest update so thank you so much bye bye take care